Alright, alright, alright. So the first thing I'm going to do is, um, I already primed my eyes and I primed my eyes with NYX's HD Primer and now I'm going to take the Dillium 2 785 brush and I'm going to dip it into Red Brick getting my brush really, really saturated in that color. And I'm going to take that and I'm going to place that into my crease. Again, I want that color to be really, really opaque, so I really went in on that color. But I only went in on it like that one time. So it should look like that. Just like that. Now I'm going to take um, Color Pops color in the color drift and it looks like this and I'll take that onto my finger and I'm going to place that onto my mobile lid and I'm going to keep patting at this because the more you pat at it and Use your fingers, it's gonna marry with that crease color, and you're really not gonna need another brush at all. And I'm just continuing to go in it to I get the opacity that I want. to take is called get lucky and it looks like this I'm gonna place that directly in the center of my eye and basically what that is gonna do is kind of give it like a mirrored effect or a um, kind of a halo around my eyes so I'm placing it again with my finger directly in the center of my eye And I'm going to clean off my finger. I'm going to go back in like a little dab of that first color. And I'm going to blend around the edges with my finger. Like that. And you're halfway done. So the next thing I'm going to do is I'm going to take a liner. And I'm basically going to tight line my eye. And I'm going to try to do the smallest, smallest bit of liner at the top of my eye. But it's not going to be really, really noticeable at all. So like I said, I'm going to tie it on. Just like that. And what it's basically doing is just coating like my lash line. And then I'm gonna do the top part off camera because I can't do it on camera, I'm just saying. Alright, so uh, now that I got my lashes on, they are the House of Lashes um, Pixie Lux Lashes. And I lined my uh, lash line with a dark shadow, basically a brown. And I use that same orangey color, red brick from MAC, to um, kind of blur out that darkness down there. Um, the next thing I'm going to do is I'm going to line my lips with MAC's Spice Pencil.
And then I am going to take um, Milk Cosmetics Lace Lipstick. And I don't quite like it, so I'm going to go over top of that and I'm going to take um, I'm going to dab on some of ColourPop Solo. So that is, again, ColourPop Solo and my glow today is Laura Geller's Gilded Honey. take some of Max Studio Fix Powder in NG43 and kind of blot these areas where I am a little bit oily and to kind of amp up my under eye highlight and I'm going to go back over my um, my glow Go back with the gilded honey um, a little bit. And this is with a Dillium Tools fan brush. I'm not gonna go heavy on blush. I'm just going to um, kind of dip my brush into of course my favorite blush I have other blushes I have a kit of blushes but I don't use them this is a cote or however you say it I haven't learned how to say it and it's just giving me a wash of color and again my eyes are freaking watering so this one my lash is not staying it's just not staying for dear life so we're going to hope that I'm not walking around somewhere and it just falls off. So, yeah, this is the finished look. And let me do a little bit of highlighting on my nose. 